Last week, I had the honor of delivering a motivational speech at the IIT's Class of 2016 graduation ceremony. Check this out. It is an honor for me to address you as you celebrate this momentous occasion in your lives. Revel in it. Bask in your light. In fact, get up. Everybody get up. Let's have a moment of silence to honor what it took, the struggle that it took for us to get here. And now, let us give ourselves a round of applause because we made it here. Thank you very much. Please be seated. I must say, you have impeccable taste for having selected me to be your guest speaker this evening. <laughs> I didn't think anybody in their right minds would ask me to address young minds as they step into the world and try this adulting thing. And yet, here we all are. I really wasn't sure what it was I was going to speak to you about tonight or what the message is that I'm supposed to share with you. So, I took a minute, I went inward, I meditated, I deliberated, and, and I thought about all the crazy, crazy things that we face in this world. I mean, our newspaper headlines alone are enough to leave us questioning whether we're even human anymore. So my deliberations with self led me to a number of life lessons which I must impart with you. This life is not for punks. Ain't nobody got time for your nonsense. Think about it. There are six billion people on this planet and we all need to coexist. So please, check all those insecurities all those personality flaws at the door. Because like I said, ain't nobody got time. Be true to yourself. Protect yourself. Do what is best for you, and most importantly, do you. Don't be out here trying to be somebody you're not, because that catches up with you right quick. Nobody has to live your life. It just makes sense to learn to understand and to like yourself, doesn't it? Show up and be the best you you can be. Nobody in this world is exactly like you are. Nobody. God thought, hmm, let me make me a you. And that's why you're here. So be authentically you at all times. That comes with the burden of representing your true self at all times. So if it doesn't feel right, just don't do it. Be humble. Know what it is that you're good at and run with it. Play your role. Live your best life. Good times would not be good if not compared to the bad. And it is who we are in the bad times that truly defines the quality of our experience of this gift of life. So, as you step out into this big, bad world, remember that every second counts, that everything you do counts, and that you really matter. Congratulations. Go out there and be the best you. And live every single day blessed and be the best you. Finally, let me leave you with an excer excerpt from a poem by my favorite poet, Maya Angelou, called Still I Rise. Out of the huts of history's shame, I rise. Up from a past that's rooted in pain, I rise. I am a black ocean, welling and swelling. I bear the tide. Leaving behind nights of terror and fear, I rise into a daybreak that's wonderfully clear, I rise. Bringing the gifts that my ancestors gave, I am the dream and the hope of the slave. I rise, I rise, I rise. Thank you. Oh,